Hey guys, and welcome back to a brand new vlog. If you're new here, hi, my name is Imani. Um, welcome to the channel. So y'all, um, I'm actually about to head out to the spa. I am dressed. I just got on this little one piece um, for the spa. Um, and I just slick my hair back again. Um, and yeah, so we're about to head out right now. I think I want to go to Nordstrom's. We have date night tonight. And we just going to get into some things, get into the fall vibes in this video. Um, but yeah, um, the weather right now, I think is about 60 some degrees. As you guys can see, the, the sun and stuff keep changing. That's because the sun keep trying to go down. But anyways, we are um, about to head out right now. My spa appointment is at 10 o'clock. Um, afterwards, I'm pretty sure I want to probably go to Nordstrom's and fasten the wear for tonight. Um, so yeah, I'll show you guys what I'm wearing so we can go ahead and head out. Okay, so y'all, this is the fit for today. I just have on my one piece from, um, Target. It's actually by the new day brand with my slides from, I think, uh, New York and Company. And then I am wearing my Coach Tabby bag today. So yeah, that's the fit for today. Just like cute, cozy, but you know, still a little summer. But like the summer is about over, y'all. So let's go. Okay, y'all, so we are now here. I'm about to head in. I'm really excited because my body is just mentally, like, in pain, for real. So this massage is going to be very needed. Also, I got my nails done the other day. I just got, like, a little black tip. I think it's so cute, especially in time for the fall season. Um, my massage therapist does my massages at her house so it's just really cozy very intimate i appreciate that um but yeah i'm about to head in and then i'm not gonna bring the camera in but i'll see you guys after we're done um when we leave here um i'm pretty sure because at first i was gonna go to the mall but i think i want to go to this like outside mall and then go to nordstrom's and then we'll just take it from there so i'll see you guys in a bit Oh, okay. This is so pretty. It's thick. Okay, y'all, so we are now in North Shelves, and it looks like they got, like, a really big sale going on. Maybe it's, like, a Labor Day sale, but, y'all, they got some cute bags. <laughs> they got some cute little bags. I haven't seen a coach yet, but these little bags are so cute. I love these. Also, let me show y'all something else I just seen that I feel like I ain't never seen before. I guess Tori Birch got these totes now. Look how cute this is. Like that totem probably. This is so cute. And I just feel like, oh, look at this one. A little toy birch. Matches. It looks cute. And then I got the, um, you know, they're coming down. Yeah, they got some other stuff in here. Let's see what they got over here. So that's more like the off-brand bags. But I'm loving these little bags too. These are really cute. Oh yeah, yeah. This is actually the brand that I had got. Like that one purse like this from, um, who was that store? Burlington? Not Burlington, but um, these bags. I had got one of these, which man was kind of different. I had got one of these from Marshalls too. That looked like a luxury dupe. It looked just like it. You would never be able to tell the difference. But I'm noticing like they put out like a lot of um, like luxury dupe bags. But yeah, they got some cute stuff over here. Let's see what this is. Oh, that little Mark Jacob is kind of cute. Then they got these little Kurt Geiger bags. Which I guess is out of London. These were cute. Oh. 
Oh, this kind of fat. Look at this little Kurt Bagger bag. These are so cute. These are going for $129 here. These are cute. Oh, I love these. These are real cute. I like these. And then I got these. Oh, cute too. And I know I just bought that coach bag, but this. But the little mini is so. I'm trying to think because it's like a rose gold. I feel like it's like a rose gold. And then they got like that little silver pouch. But right? Kurt Geiger, how huh? they coming in with some fire. Y'all, yeah, they got wallets inside this little case. And this is where you can just get like the luxury items at. Because they always got to put up. These, these is cute. These little toy purchases is cute too. But in here, they got this little cabinet and they be having like little accessories and stuff. And just like real pieces. And I'm looking in here to see if they got something here I like. Oh, this is cute. This is cute. Now I can tell like their decor is just like real like trendy. Like this is pretty though, but I think I like real trendy like decor. Like the vases are real popular. Um just like little stuff like this, which is cute. It's just not my style. But it's cute. I think it'd be cute for like office spaces and stuff. And then, so you can tell what they just got. Like this is very unique. Like I've never <laughs> I've never seen this is this is different. I've never seen anything like that. But I mean you can just tell where they got like just different little pieces. Now this is kind of a different piece. I feel like I would probably use something like this just for like I don't know. I take that back. I don't know. But I think for like cute little office spaces and stuff like that, this type of stuff would be really cute. Like this is all like little office stuff. Like <laughs> I would put stuff like this in the office. But it just got like different colors and like. Yeah, so that's like the decor that they got. These are really cute. I like these vases. These are really pretty. I like those. You could tell where they kind of trying to put some little fall stuff out. I think this is really pretty as well. And then this is different. This is kind of cute. I like it too as well. That's cute. So apparently these little mushrooms are very popular for this fall season, okay? <laughs> and they just got like, I guess these are supposed to be like pumpkins. Those are different. And then they got just like a few pumpkins. It's like a really cute like glass pumpkin. It's real cute. And then they got like this like metallic one. This is actually plastic. Sort of. It's kind of plastic but it's cute. And then they got this gold one for the glam girls. Really pretty though. And then everything else is like random, just like random stuff, like random, just like home stuff. Um, what is this? That's a mic. Oh, that just bring me some ideas because I swear I want to start something different on YouTube. But they just got like different, just different little stuff. Also, they towels and they washcloths and stuff be really high quality as well, if you guys don't know. This is like their candle. And maybe you know it's that season when they put the Uggs out. So are these the Uggs they putting out this year? I am low-key a fan, but not. I'm kind of torn, but these, <laughs> they're kind of different, but I kind of like them. I don't know. I kind of like these a little bit. 
much? How much? Let's see how much these are. They don't have. Yeah. Let's see what they have. Can I sell I don't know, but yeah. Oh, so they got Ugg shoes. Okay, so they just got like different little like Ugg shoes. Ugg boots. Then they got the cozy throws. They got all the colors. Also, like I said, they got under. It's, it's almost for like Christmas with how they got these signs out. But they got like all these little throws, which are really pretty. Yeah, look at this watch. Now, y'all know I'm a watch girl. This is so cute and tiny. I'm like, I don't have a tiny one like this. This is so cute. I think I'm going to get this. It's not. Yeah, I think I'm going to get this. Also, I just found these really cute, like, stud earrings. Y'all know I like these small earrings. I think they're so cute. I'm not really a big earring girl, but. Oh, also, this Natasha brand is a really nice brand in here. So, y'all, yeah, we over here in shoes. And I just found these boots right here, y'all. And I just thought these were so cute. They in a size 10. I always size up. But y'all, when I put them on, they are uncomfortable. I don't know what it is. I think it's the heel. But they're a really good price. They're like 35. Thought these was cute. But I think I want to try to find like a little boot like this. So we just over here in the little shoes. Seeing what they got. Also, I really want to get these Adidas. I need to get these because I've been wanting to get these so bad. These are a size nine. That's my size. Yeah, that's so cute. This thing looks like it's even gonna be kind of big, for real. Okay, yeah, that's the nine right there. That's cute. But I just feel like they can be like. I might get those. And then I had got my feet done the other day. It's my toes so cool. But yeah. I might get these. Because these are like good for airports. So yeah, I might get these. What else they got? What is this? This is the same shoe. Okay, this is a different shoe. But, but, this is a kitten heel. Let's see what this is. Something at the bottom that just kind of got them like not right, but they're really cute with that calf. <laughs> also, I feel like the shoe is kind of wide, but they're cute though, but it's kind of wide. That's a 10. Yeah, why they got the mini perfumes in here? They got the mini perfumes in here. That is crazy. Wow. That is so crazy. They got Jimmy Choo and they be going for like 12. I can imagine they probably got sprays. They probably like little oils. But the fact that they even got this type of stuff is insane. The little small minis, wow. What's this one? Versace. Victor Firebomb. Jimmy Choo Man. And then I say this Jimmy Choo Elite. These are really cute though. Y'all, I forgot all about y'all. I am so sorry. Anyways, this is the date night outfit. Um, dress I got from H&M. Shoes are from Nordstrom's. I just got this ponytail today. Really cute. Um, earrings, H&M. Watch, Nine West. And I got my ring on. This is the dupe that I was telling y'all about that I got from TJ Maxx. And it's the dupe too. I want to say, I forget the person, but yeah. Thought the dress was really cute. It's like a ribbed like material. Anyways, 
I'm rushing as you guys can see. I'm about to head out and I will see you guys later. Hey loves and welcome back to a brand new day. So today is actually Sunday um, and I just did a little self care this morning. Made a little avocado toast and a coffee as you guys can see. Um, I am currently about to head out to Panera Bread. I am having a kind of like girls Sunday with my friend um, just to kind of support each other, kind of catch up. Super excited for that. Um, and basically I'm about to head out. So I'm going to bring Panera Bread to basically like the table basically i'm not sure what she gonna bring but i'm gonna go head out and get some panera bread i already got her order what she want and then i think i'm gonna do some cookies and probably some hot chocolate later um i am dressed for today um i'll show you guys what i'm wearing it's very simple um and i'm loving the dainty chains and stuff so this was the ponytail i had got yesterday when I had went on my date night yesterday, um, it was a little too long, so I did go ahead and cut it. I think I like it better kind of cut shorter though. I think it's super cute. I'll show you guys what I'm wearing and then we're gonna head out. This is actually the outfit that I am wearing today. I have on this white shirt that I ended up getting from, I think I had got this from Marshalls. These like oversized like joggers came from Sheen. That is basically the look, just like, just chill, but still cute and comfy. I think it's like the perfect indoor, sunday girls day so i'm really excited so this is what i'm about to go wear to go pick up food and i will see you guys later also y'all this is the perfume that i'm wearing it is by um ultra ultra has this perfume that i had got um in this heaven speak i forget who it's the dupe to but it smells really really good and i love it so yeah this is the perfume of today I did kind of move like my office area around. I'm actually watching G right now. It's a little too loud, but um, I am actually watching G, um, Journey Gamatia on YouTube. But yeah, I just kind of switched my office around slash bedroom, I guess or whatever. But this is how she's looking right now, real cute. I just want to update you guys. Um, this little vase right here, I got these florals right here. I want to say from... Um, where did this come from? I think Home Goods with this little vase right here. Um, and then I put my computer back in the middle of my desk. And then over here, I just put my um, sign. I just put my flyer right here for decorating. And then I just put this candle right here. And I just think it looks so cozy. You would be shocked at like when you just switch your space up a little bit. Just how more refreshed and better it looks. So that's how that looks. Also, if you guys are curious, this is actually the shelf that was actually, um, that had like all my stuff on it, um, my closet and stuff like that, where they had like all my purses and all that, but this is how it looks right now. Just kind of random with just like some random boxes, my sandals and stuff like that, how that looks. Also, another update, I took this picture and brought it in here, and then I put this um, green throw right here, but this is the picture that I ended up getting from the Goodwill, y'all. And I just wanted a picture in here to just look a little bit more better instead of my two pictures that I always do. So I'm thinking about hanging this up and I just think it looks real chic in the room. For the most part, the room is pretty plain. As you guys can see, this room never really has a ton going on because it is my office last um, like closet and stuff like that. So that's this is how this room is looking right now. I just wanted to update you guys. 
because i'll be feeling like i'll be doing little stuff to this um room sometime and i'm like let me just show them like kind of like have a look behind the scene but anyways i'm about to head out to panera real quick to grab the food not sure when i'll pop back on camera but we do have a few more updates and stuff to show you guys before we actually um close out today's video so yeah i'll see you guys in a bit okay y'all so we're now back at the house and i just got our food from panera bread i went ahead and laid out these like plate bowls right here i did get these from i think where these come from i think they was at home yeah i got these like little bowl like plates from at home and i just kind of just put them on each side um i'm gonna put her food over here for her. And then I'm gonna put mine over here. I was thinking about setting it out, but I think I'm gonna just sit it right there for now. I did get a bottle of Chardonnay. So I do have a bottle of Chardonnay. Just like a little cute, small, little mini bottle. Um, I'm going to set our glasses here. You know, just like a little bottle of wine. Some wine glasses, real cute, but simple. But yeah, so we got some wine, we got our food, and then she's going to bring what she's going to bring, and I will see you guys later. Good morning, guys. So today is a new day. Today's actually Monday. I'm actually about to head out to work. Um, I'm going to come back later and pick back up the camera, but I wanted to show you guys what I was wearing today. I think it's so cute. And I took my um, charm off my necklace um, and just did like this just dainty just charm. I think it's so cute. Also, I don't know if I told y'all, but I got my nails done um and i end up getting focus i end up getting a black tip um on my nails super cute for fall so that's how my nails look but i want to show you guys my outfit today and we're going to come back and do some other stuff so okay y'all so this is my outfit for today um my pants came from target i do think these are like a, just a little bit too big right here um i think i probably should get like a 10 next time but i got these trousers right here from target and then i'm wearing this black and white striped shirt from target as well um belt is from target i love it so cute um and then i have on my hermes dupes which came from target as well so that is the full look i think it is so cute i think i'm gonna go ahead and do my um coach um tabby bag right here i think it's super super cute and i'm going to do this with the look today and this is the complete look i really hope i'm not out of focus because for some reason i feel like the camera keep blurring but anyways so um, also, I put my hair in a ponytail. So that's how my hair look in a ponytail. Um, the watch that I'm wearing, Nine West watch, my ring. And then I'm also wearing my coach bracelet as well. So yeah, this is the full look. I want you guys to comment, let me know. And y'all, I want a new coach bag so bad, but y'all, these bags are expensive. <laughs> but um, I want a coach bag so bad, like a black one. I have one, but I want like another shoulder one. But yeah, that's the look for today. Let me know what you guys think. And let me pull it down so I feel like you guys can see my shoes with it. Okay, y'all. So I wanted to pull the camera down so you guys can actually see my shoes with it as well. So that's the complete look. Um, I will link everything if you guys are interested in anything that I showed you guys uh, with this look today. So I'm about to head to work. And I hope you guys have a good day. Bye, guys. Hey, y'all. So we are back at the house. Um... I got off work a little earlier, but I did stop at Target to grab a couple items. Y'all, today has been a really long day today. <laughs> today was really long today. Anyways, um, I stopped at Target to grab a couple items. When I put lotion on, I actually add oil to my lotion. So I did come across this fragrance-free moisturizing bath oil and grapeseed oil with oil and pumpkin seed oil in it um this is how it look and it said it's fragrance free i got this from target because my other one is actually going out and it actually is the up and up brand so and it's fragrance free so that's good so i guess you can add it to your bath or anything but i, I normally like add like oils to my lotion because i feel like it hydrates it more to me like lotion just do not hydrate me enough like so i'll be always adding oil to my lotion i want you guys to comment and let me know do y'all be adding oil to y'all lotion too because i swear it is very hydrating especially in the summertime it'll have you looking like a buttery soft i love it so next y'all i got let me see. also y'all i did go ahead and make some tea i think i showed you guys but i just made some tea this is actually a everyday detox tea 
um, with lemon. I actually did just start um, using these. Oh, it's hot, girl. I did just start using these just to kind of detox my body because I feel like I don't detox my body enough. And like I said, you can take them every day, um, but I really like them and I think they really work. And it ain't really got a, like to me, it ain't really, ha it don't really have a taste to it, but I could tell it does things to me. So I did like add like a little, um, like I said, it's, it's barely, it's barely in, like literally you really cannot taste anything. You could probably taste like a hint, like a hint of the lemon. And then I added some, um, I added some, um honey in there as well but y'all how cute is this little glass isn't she so cute i'm pretty sure this is one of my goodwill finds um it's a tea um glass it says nature does not hurry yet everything is so accomplished yeah so real cute so yeah i'm sipping on this right now um i like to sip on tea after work I find that it's very soothing. I just really like to have like warm like drinks and stuff. Anyways, y'all, I end up getting these scrunchies by Conair. Um, no damage. It's like elastic 20 piece. As you guys know, I've been doing a lot of protective styles with my hair because I have not got my hair done yet. Um, and I still don't even know when I'm going to get my hair done, to be honest. But I'm supposed to be going out of town this month. So we'll see how that goes. But um, I did get these scrunchies right here because I feel like I keep losing my scrunchies so I'm like let me go ahead and buy me a pack these was only like 222 Target got some really um good scrunchies and they also got the goodie ones I like the goodie ones as well but I got some of these also I end up getting these um new earrings y'all these are so cute they just got way too much cute stuff in there and that's why I be having to be real careful when I go in Target because I promise I can go in there for nothing and come out with everything like it's not even funny like they just got too much, just too much cute stuff. Y'all, they had these really cute earrings. Look at these. Y'all, look how cute. And I was like, how adorable are these little circle earrings? And they just real like, they just look luxury to me. And I swear, these about to go with all my glasses. I just love these. I thought these were so cute. Like, I like the ones that I got in right now. They just like a little smaller. But I definitely needed like an earring like this. I think it'll be so cute. And they're actually by um, a New Day brand. But you guys see the details of like the rope? Like that is so cute. And these was actually $8. And I'll link everything guys. And I think these was like $2.29. And then the oil um, I think was like $5. I think yeah $4.99. And then, um, again, we all know it's cozy season, so I ended up getting some Ready Whip as well. I think this was like $3. Y'all, Ready Whip is so expensive. It's not even funny. And I normally get the extra creamy, but girl, the extra creamy was like $5. And I'm like, no, it's not that serious. <laughs> so I got some of this because I got some hot chocolate, and I think I'm going to do some hot chocolate tonight. So that's that. Now, I did grab um, like this like sweater vest. That I want to show y'all. And y'all, I grabbed it out the kids section. section, And it was still like $20. Like, bro. It was still like $20. But I found this really cute, like, vest. So, y'all, this is like the sweater vest. And the sweater is not even too thick. It's like perfect. Y'all, I love this. It's like a black and white stripe. And like I said, this did come from the kids section. And this is in a 14. I love this. This is so cute. And But I ain't gonna lie. You could tell it's a kids section. But because my chest is not too big and I feel like up here it's not like huge, I feel like I'll be able to fit it and it'll be like not really cropped, but like it'll fit me just right. Um, and I love that it got like a little bit of stretch in it as well. So we do got a little bit of a stretch and I kind of want to try it on real quick. Hold on. So y'all, this is how the sweater look. It is so cute and it just looks so classy. Like I said, it's an extra large. Um, and it came from the kids section and it is in the 14. I don't even think, I don't even think the kids go up to a 16, but as you can see, it fits perfectly. I love, love the way that it fit. It fits so cute. Like I love that. 
So yeah, this is how I look. And I think it's gonna be real cute, especially with like my earrings and stuff. Oh, it's gonna be a vibe. Like the earrings I just got, I think those are gonna be look so cute in here. I think those will look so cute with this shirt. So yeah, this is how the shirt look. I love it, it's cute. Let me know what y'all think. Also y'all, I wanna show y'all this new book that I'm reading. I'm reading this book called Emotional Intelligence, y'all. It is so good. I ended up getting it off Amazon. I will link it if you guys are interested. And y'all, I ended up ordering these really cute um, bookmarks right here. And they like magnet. Y'all, they so cute. I want to show y'all these real quick. And basically, you can just put it on your book. I don't, I don't even know where my other one went to. But basically, it's just like little magnets like this. And they just different colors. And you can like open them up right here. And you can like put them inside your book. And like they will like, like stick to your book like that. And save your page. Like how cute is that? Also too, um, I have this light right here that I want to tell you guys about. I got this book light from Amazon as well. It does have three settings on it. And you can just pretty much clip it right onto your book. So like it has a clip right here and then a light is right here. And this is how it looks. So if I put it on here, I normally clip my light in the back. And then it, it has like a click up here, like a button. It has a button up here and you can just click on the button like that. So convenient. And it has like three modes on the light. I love that. So it does have three modes on there. I'm gonna turn the light down so you can see. But how cute and convenient is this book light when you're reading at night. So I wanna show you guys this. But y'all, this book is really, really good. This is actually the book that I'm reading, which again is called Emotional Intelligence. So good. I would recommend anybody to um, read this book. I think we all need to read this book. Just to kind of like know how to, to like, you know, just know how emotions work and controlling our emotions, whether if it's like at work, it's in with people, partners, just everything. This is a really good book and I love these um, bookmarks as well. And yeah, I for oh, also too y'all, let me tell y'all. So all the way in the back of this book, also guys, it has this EQ test with this passcode in here in the back of the book where you go online and it's basically like a little um, thing where you can go online and take a test and see what your score is and it's for free. And they give you the passcode right here for you to take the emotional um, intelligence test. Love that. This is a really, really good book. I highly recommend. It is definitely a good book. I want you guys to comment and let me know. Have you guys read a emotional intelligence book? And if you have, what do you think about it? I'm pretty sure this is actually the page that I'm on right here, actually. This is actually the page that I'm on. It's crazy. I just started the book, but it's really good. Let me see. This is the what emotional intelligence look like, understanding, and the four skills. So yeah, um, this is what I'm on because I ended off right here the other night. So yeah, this is it. So yeah, it just gives you all type of just um just all type of information, and I just think it's really helpful just for the brain in general. And it could just give you like little tests, and it just tells you like little things in here that I feel like is just really important in life. So I love this book. So this is the book that I'm reading right now. Um, again, I will have the light linked in the book as well if you guys are interested. So yeah, with the bookmarks. Hey girl, so it is a little bit later in the evening, y'all, and I'm about to head to Target. So as you guys know, I've been talking about like detoxing my body, <laughs> trying to live a healthier lifestyle. So I do wanna go to Target and look for some um, gut cleanse and some fiber. Um, so that's what we're actually about to go do. Um, with that being said, I want to thank Bellway for sponsoring today's video. We're actually going to head out to Target. If you guys don't know, Bellway actually has products inside of Target, Walmart, CVS, and all types of locations to get any type of fiber from or any type of like collagen. You can get it in gummies. Um, you can get it in powder as well. We're going to go ahead and head to Target and pick up our order and I'm very excited. Also, they have a buy one get one free as well and I'll show you guys how to do that. So, let's head out. Okay guys, so we're going to head to my local Target to pick up our Bellway products. I am super excited. So guys, keeping your gut healthy is very important because it affects your whole body, especially your digestive system. 
weight, immune system, heart, brain, hair, skin, and nails. Bellwood takes care of your gut, helping you maintain a healthy weight. Also, guys, it reduces bloating and have other amazing benefits like keeping healthy blood glucose levels and lower cholesterol levels as well. Bellway Fiber Plus Fruit is an organic, vegan, all-natural, keto-friendly, and gluten-free fiber supplement that contains zero sugar. They also have a Super Fiber Gummies, the only organic fiber gummy on the market, and they also have kosher and vegan, and they have collagen plus fiber. It's made with organic psyllium husk, collagen, hyaluronic acid, and real fruit as well. Bellway made with a super fiber called psyllium husk that nourishes your gut. It's keeping your gut regular without making you run to the bathroom. It also helps you stay fuller longer so it can be easily avoided for you to not want those unhealthy cravings that you always have. You can find Bellway fibers in your local stores. Just use their store locator on the website. They're available in Walmart, Target, CVS, Kroger, and more. And now for a limited time, they're offering 100% cash back for one product. Head to your local Target, grab two tubs of Bellway Super Fiber plus fruit and Bellway will reverse you one free tub. All you have to do is click the link in my description or scan the QR code, follow the instructions, and buy Bellway at Target. Okay, real quick, y'all. I wanted to do an outfit of today and I wanted to show you guys how it turned out. Okay, let me put my phone down. <laughs> so I'm actually headed out to work, y'all. Um, and the sweater that I was telling y'all that I got from the kids section yesterday, this is the sweater that I got from Target. This is the sweater. It looks so cute. Um, pants Target. I hate this little flap right here. It's so annoying. Um, pants are Target as well. Trousers. Uh, but yeah, this is the sweater. Like, isn't she so cute? She turned out so nice. I really hope y'all can see me really good. But anyways, this is the sweater. It's like a striped sweater. Looks really cute, y'all. And these are the earrings. Um, when I stepped back, this is the whole fit. So what I did was I went ahead and tucked um, this little sweater part. Now, it's not that long, granted. But I did tuck what I could. I like the fact that it's fitted. Because I feel like by it being fitted, it just looks better. So I did go ahead and tuck it. Um, these are a 12, by the way, at Target. I still feel like a 10 would have been better. These are the exact ones that I have in um, the black ones. Um, also, I went ahead and did my watch for my accessories and my ring. Also, I am wearing um, Ambry Saffron by Dacier, um, which is the Backrock Rose Jupe. And I'm going to wear my Coach purse with this. I think it just matches so cute. Also, I'm going to do my... I don't know if I had the black ones on last time or not, but no, I did not. <laughs> I'm going to do my black um, Hermes dupes from Target. And I just want to show y'all this real quick. I'm actually on my way to work. Uh, by the way, y'all, I am loving the new <laughs> location. Um, it's bigger. It's more inspiring. I'm very excited. Um, also, my necklace. That's the necklace that I'm wearing. Okay, y'all. So right here is the whole entire outfit with my coach bag, which looks so cute. I'm definitely getting more into like these classic looks that look very timeless. I think they're going to go on for years and years um, <laughs> in just like clothes and fashion. So I love this look. Um, this is how the back looks with the sweater. Super cute. And also I am loving the ponytails right now. You guys know that I am loving a ponytail. So yeah guys, this is the look for today. Um, and I will see you guys later. Hope you guys have a good day. Mwah. Hey y'all and welcome to the same day. Um, I just got off work a little minute ago and I wanted to do a home update real quick. And I also wanted to show you guys this picture I ended up getting from Target that I want to put on my mantle today. I think it's really, really cute. And I think it's really going to like bring me really into that style that I've really been kind of gearing towards. But I have not went there all the way. But you guys have been seeing how my style been evolving with like the vintage modern chic. But I feel like this is kind of a style that I kind of want to like go for but still try to keep my modern chic style so i'm gonna show you guys okay y'all so this is the picture frame that i just purchased recently from target it was actually on a sale the original price for this frame 
was actually I believe like $18 I'm going to kind of turn the um, brightness down just so you guys can really get a feel for um, the style so this is what I just got recently now when I see this it, it just it really resonates with me like I don't know what it is <laughs> well first off I think it's the colors and the timelessness about it um, I'm finding that my styles that like how I dress and like my home is just becoming more like timeless more like organic um, like modern chic like on a different type of level and I'm really loving these type of vibes I don't know what it is but also what I noticed too y'all is that the frame is gold and now you guys know I have not did gold in a long time but this is how the trim looks on the frame and it just gives like that very like just very like modern like organic feel and for some reason I'm just really loving this style right now now I ain't trying to go crazy because I can tell where it's, it's really getting trendy these type of styles where it's just kind of like less is more and just kind of got like that old type of like time art but I'm loving it I think anything like this will go really cute on any type of um, mantle um, you can hang this in your kitchen also I think this will go really cute on our shelves in the kitchen but y'all today what I'm gonna do with this art is I'm gonna go ahead and put this on our mantle because I just think it will look so cozy especially with like the cream the browns um, you know the goals I feel like it would really match our decor really pretty for the fall season so I wanted to layer this up there and show you guys how it would look and just kind of give you guys a feel of um, what I was talking about as far as the style also I love obviously that it is a neutral style and it looks really really pretty um, and this is actually by um, Threshold as well so this is by Threshold uh, this is how the back look but I am just loving this style um, it's definitely coming back out from back in the day like these are the type of picture frames and styles that was like more popular like back in the day but yeah I am loving this I think this is a very cozy style and I just think this really elevates you know any type of space it looks really high end it looks very expensive so we're gonna go ahead and layer this on our um which I know is gonna go perfect we're gonna go ahead and put this on our shelf mantle in our living room with our fall decor and layer it in there and see how it looks so yeah comment below if you guys kind of got this style or if you guys see where this style is kind of coming back let me know your thoughts okay y'all so this is a quick home update i wanted to show you guys i did just put these um candle holders out i think they're so cozy i've had these for a while now you guys know that i have been a candle holder girl for a minute so i did go ahead and take um sorry about the blur i did go ahead and take my candles that i end up getting from amazon my electric candles with the flame um and i just went ahead and just placed my black candle holders on it I think it is so cozy. I think it looks so cute. So that is the first update. And this is actually in our dining room. If you guys have not seen this video, um, be sure to check it out. Um, I believe this was included with our kitchen um, in our dining room, obviously, um, decor for the fall season. So if you guys have not checked that out, I will link that video. But yeah, I just thought it was so cute in the corner. So that's the first update. Our second update is actually the rug in the dining room. So if you guys don't know, I have not put a rug in the dining room yet. I hadn't did it yet at all. So we do have a rug in here now. This is actually the rug that was in my bedroom. I did bring it in here. I think it looks a lot better in the dining room and I can definitely tell where we just really needed a rug in this area. So glad we put it in here. And I just think it looks so much better with the rug. Like I said, the time right now is almost 7.30, so that's why it's a little dark in the house, so please excuse that. But um, this rug came from Amazon. It's like a Jonathan rug. I think it turned out really, really cute. Um, but yeah, it's like a cream color, and I just love how it is separated from the actual carpet, and it really just stands out more, so I love that. I'm going to take the frame, and I'm going to layer it like right here. It ain't got dark outside. Yeah, I'm trying to get this video out for y'all. <laughs> so I'm 
So I think I'm gonna layer the frame right there. And I just think layering that frame on there just look so, I can't even do. Like, <laughs> y'all, I just think it looks so good. Then I was gonna take the pumpkin and like put the pumpkin like right here. And just kind of just let it sit right there. Like how? <laughs> hey, this I'm telling you, y'all, I love what I do when I say <laughs> when I say I love what I do. Like, oh my god, I love what I do. This is a little black pumpkin. You really can't see it, but I kind of want to like place it like right there. I just think that is so cute. You can't even see the black pumpkin. Hold on. Let me see, can y'all see it now? So that's how it looks so far. But then I'm like, I feel like I want the, I feel like I want my candle right here, but I'm like, I low key want to hide the candle now and just kind of put the candle in the back and kind of hide it. Just because I feel like it doesn't really need to be in the forefront, if that makes any sense. Because I don't want to cover the picture. So I'm like, let me just take the candle and put the candle kind of kind of in the back a little bit. Because it, you know, that's super cozy. <laughs> I know you really can't see it, but I don't know if I really care for the candle to really be seen. I feel like I kind of like it in the back. It's kind of high, you know, I'm not going to lie. And y'all, why the other day, y'all know when we just had our little friends, little dinner thing. Why the other day, the, can <laughs> the candles start burning, girl. And look what it did to my candles. They start burning and they start running. I was like, oh my goodness. Y'all, candle wax was everywhere. It was literally insane. So, I had to. <laughs> so, basically, I had ended up taking them down. And I like try to clean them off as much as possible. But y'all, my candles end up um they end up um melting. And I don't even know because at first, so this is what I think happened. I think what happened was is like once I started to um I think once I had trimmed the wick, I feel like that's when it started to um burn differently. And it was just crazy. But anyways, this is how it's looking right now. I kind of like the candles lit. <laughs> it's so cozy. But I don't want to like, you get what I'm saying? I don't want it to like keep melting and burning. Like, but y'all, how cozy is this? <laughs> I cannot get over this right now. It look so good. So, and the reason why, obviously, I wanted to just light the vibes up for y'all. So, that's why I lit these candles. But, girl, I am going to unlight those because <laughs> y'all not about to be burning down, getting on the wood, girl. We don't we don't need no fires, okay? But, anyways, y'all, this is how it turned out. And I think it is so gorgeous. I think this picture really elevates the space. It's something about, so, also what I'm learning is, is that I'm learning to put different, like, because y'all know, like, I'm a real minimal girl. But I'm finding that I'm starting to really get into details when it comes to decor instead of just being so like structured with it. But you guys know that I'm only like real structured. Like it's, I'm like to the T with my decor. Like I don't ever do like any extra. But I'm finding that I'm doing like little detailed things. And that's what's really, to me, making the decor more interesting in my opinion. Like right now, I feel by me like layering that picture and putting a candle in the back and, you know, um, Putting a couple of items over here, it's just like to me those little details really like bring the space together if that makes any sense. So that's one thing that I love. But yeah, this is how it's looking so far. I want you guys to comment and let me know what you think. I think it turned out absolutely just stunning.
Thank mm-hmm. you.